And on that note, welcome to another edition of the San Diego Prep Insider Golf Podcast. I am Christian Pedersen. This is Mr. Coach Klein. You want to go ahead and introduce yourself? I'm Sophia Carrillo. I'm a senior at St. Francis Parker High School. Hello. She's also the team captain on the golf team here. You guys are practicing. Um, they had to pull you off the driving range because you were hitting the other end of it <laughs> and, and scaring the Patrick Henry's team off of it. Um, we got some shout outs for the last week of golf, another great week of golf here, and uh, we're gonna get to hear a little bit about Parker's season so far. Coach, let's start with some of the best golfers in the county, how they do last week. Sure, we have uh, top five teams, we talked about that last time, and uh, continuing Ranch Bernardo, the great play from, uh, from their team, uh, two wins this last week. Uh, Calicitas Reyes, uh, nice 37, Stephanie Lee. Uh, Stephanie uh, Heimler had 35, and Serena Kai had a 36. So uh, you know, can continue to play right around par, and uh, great effort. Uh, Modern Day still remains the number two team. Uh, expect that to, to remain the same. Uh, they played uh, East Lake, had a nice win there. Brianna uh, Navarosa, terrific player, uh, shot 33. Um, their number two player, uh, Ivana Montemayor, um, shot 35, so nice round for her, Christian, um, doing well. Uh, now, you've seen some of these teams in person, correct? I played with, I believe, Cathedral Catholic my sophomore year, and then modern day we may have played once or twice. So, yeah, I've seen these teams, and they're very strong teams. So we're, she can testify. These people are the real deal. Oh, I mean, yeah, this for is sure. Not, we're not talking about a gimme 37 on a pitch and oh, putt. Oh, no. Like, like this is, these yeah. are real real deal on real golf courses. Good good play. Uh, Cathedral of Catholic, as we uh, mentioned. Hashtag rolled on. Uh, yeah, last week. <laughs> there you go. Uh, Sabrina Nguyen uh, had a nice 34. Uh, Mia Garcia had a nice 36. Um, uh, rounding out uh, that group, we get into Scripps Ranch, which uh, had a plethora of matches last week. They had That's four. our SAT word of the week, plethora. There you go. <laughs> Spell it. Uh, I, you can't ask me to spell those things. Perfect. <laughs> um, and this is an opportunity to lift up uh, Napua Glossner. Uh, she uh, she had three nice rounds oh, in the 30s. Uh, 36 was her low, so um, she's having a good season. Um, finally, uh, number five, Tori Pines. Uh, two matches, and they're led by uh, Vanessa Ho and uh, Summer Yang. So good, good um, group there. So how's the season been going for you guys, though? Pretty good. We've had, I believe, three matches, and we have another one tomorrow. And we've been playing very well. We've been our top player has been out for a little bit, so we've been holding down the fort as she's getting better. And each each match, we're getting better, and we're coming out and practicing, and making sure that we're getting our fundamentals down, and getting the small things to make sure the bigger picture looks better. Who are you guys taking on tomorrow? Tomorrow we play, I believe, Bishops? Bishops tomorrow. So. Now, Bishops? is that B-I-S-H-O-P-S question mark? Yes, okay. Yes. <laughs> uh, Schedules aren't very set here in golf. It's not quite go. like football where you spend all week looking toward that one Friday night. It's kind of like, just, let's just day. show up. And that that yeah. kind of shows how individual of a sport it is. Yeah. You know, it could be somebody from another country coming into golf next week. You're like, eh. I'm just going to go golf fresh. by game. <laughs> it's true, you know. I mean, that is one of the joys of I I love, and and um, I think Sophia, I hope Sophia would agree. I believe so. But, you know, it's, it's really uh, a wonderful sport in the sense that it is a team. We have team captains. We do things as a group, but it really is played as an individual sport once you get out there um, and are in competing. So, so I'm going to put you on the hot seat for a second. Okay. Is he a... Coach that you're kind of scared of? Is he the the, the friendly coach? Give us a little insight into Coach Klein. Well, Coach Klein, I have a lot of love for him. He's very sweet and he's very kind. But when he need, he's not. He's never too strict. It's always helpful, encouraging, encouraging words, making sure that we're feeling good and asking us how our days went. And we like to ask him how his day went too. We don't always want to know what he does. You don't follow his Snapchat <laughs> stories. I don't follow his Snapchat stories. I bet it's a lot of golf. We found out that Mr. Coach Klein is on Snapchat and knows definitively who Chance the Rapper is. <laughs> so Aaron Bergen, our basketball analyst, right. Tommy, Noah, our football analysts, uh, DeMeo, our, our, our lacrosse analysts, you've all been put on blast <laughs> by Coach Klein here because he, he, he just took over. the. He's running the game now in terms of the <laughs> hippest analyst that SCPI employs. There you go. Uh, Second question. Yes. 
I like to ask this about you know you, you got a superstition you know I, I know that sometimes mm -hmm. you like I, I have that one ball that I really like I you know I have to have the, my bag a certain mm -hmm. way golfers can be kind of weird people so yeah. is there is there one thing that's been going well for you this season I like using a certain type of tee it's plastic tee and I just think it hits better and they're taller and you don't have to screw around with it too much and I think that's one of my superstitions I also I have the Titleist ball that I've been using this year and it's been working really well so I like to have those two combos and that's So if good. you ever see her digging around in, in the, the sand trap or out <laughs> in the ocean she's just hunting after that one Titleist ball. Is there one thing you're looking forward to still this season? I know senior year it can be a kind of a, a, of a, of a bittersweet thing to have that last season of golf. Is there one match, one course, one hole that you're looking forward to? Well, I think last week we played La Jolla Country Club, and I think it's always a privilege to play there, even though it's a tough course, and I've been privileged to play it, I believe, three times now, and I think that's my highlight of my senior year so far, it's just being able to play that such a great course where pros like Phil Mickelson and other pros have played there, and it's just a nice feeling. So. There you go. Yeah. Any more shout outs? Anyone else we want to get to? Yeah, let's finish uh, with a couple of uh, individual players. We mentioned uh, Lauren Gomez with Point Loma. Lauren's continuing to play well, still averaging under par uh, 35 yesterday. I can't even do that in a video just, game. Uh, <laughs> she's, uh, she's awesome. She's, she's, uh, she's our one to watch. Um, we also have an uh, OLP, uh, OLP player who's um, she's uh, been playing a wonderful game last year, and I think she's uh, taking it, uh, you know, continuing to improve this year, uh, Catalin uh, Turaldi, and um, and then from Francis Parker, uh, Carolyn Garay, she rounds out the top eight. So Carolyn's having a, having a really great season as well. So we got up north, down south, out east, here in the Central City. This is, I, you know, we talked about this a little bit with the guys side last year. This is stopping being just coastal only and it's starting to really expand all over the county as golf seems to really be taking over from what was just a, a, a few schools to now the whole county is getting involved in it. Um, we will let you guys, I think you said chipping is next? That's it. We're off to work on other gonna parts go, of our game. Going to go work so on the short we'll game here. Short game Good luck now. to you the Thank rest of the season. And, uh, Listen to some Chance the Rapper or something. Uh, we'll, we'll see you guys next week on another edition of our golf podcast. <laughs> there we go.